Well, that's a very interesting question. Um, it has not changed the way I do my work because I am retired from the workforce, so I'm at home anyway. My studio is at home, and um, I typically am in my studio Monday through Friday all day. So that hasn't changed at all. The one little thing that's changed is since I can't really go anywhere, I am delighted to be stuck in my studio. <laughs> all of the works in shelter, except for one, were done several years ago. And at the time, um, so they, at the time when I did them, they had nothing to do with shelter at home, had nothing to do with, with stay at home, had nothing to do with the pandemic at all. Um, but what, you know, what I'd like to think is that when you, when you make some good art and it's really good, it's um, somewhat timeless. I'd like to think that, you know, <laughs> being an art maker. Um, I, had, I, I did a whole huge series of houses, homes, dwellings, um, several years ago. And a lot of them have, were sold. Um, they just resonated with people so much. And then um, the ones that didn't sold, I was in my studio maybe a month ago and I looked over and I saw one of the ones that's in shelter. And I thought, oh my gosh, that is so, so relevant for right now. <clears throat> and it was one of the ones that has a house made of sticks that's being anchored in place with rocks. So there's this sort of um, dichotomy of fragility and stability. So, you know, I looked over at that and I thought, man, this is so right for now. You know, we're in our homes. They, they're, they have to be our sanctuary, but how, how safe are they? You know, with some of the stress that people are going through and um, the difficulty and the challenges of being stuck at home, there is that dichotomy in people's lives right now. Well, the subject matter that I'm, that I'm working on now um, is mostly skies and water. I'm very interested in expanses. And um, with the pandemic and the whole shelter in place, my interest in, in that subject matter and that theme has not changed at all. I feel like um, people really need to feel that openness, the possibility, to have possibility thinking. And in the vastness of the sky and the vastness of the ocean, you can have that. It's, it's, it's bigger than we are, it's huge. Which sometimes makes you feel very, very small, but I think also there's something about the expanse, especially of the sky, that is hopeful. <clears throat> and I think people need that now.